this morning i just got to the warehouse where it's at i used to shoot with this client a lot so i've been here before i'm gonna try to take the camera in with me and get a little behind the scenes so you guys can see what it's like on set <laughs> I'm back from LA. I'm literally gonna shower and get re ready and then go back up there because tonight is one of my friend's birthdays. These are my girlfriends from college and I haven't seen them in a really long time. So I'm really excited to see them and to celebrate with them. But I'm gonna go shower, get ready for the night, and then take you guys with me. I got these hair extensions off of Amazon. The color is like pretty close. I'm gonna try to put them in for tonight and see how that looks. <laughs> Is this the fight that I'm searching for? The great inside behind the door. It's literally two o'clock in the morning, but we gotta take the dog out. The next morning, my parents came in town, so I went and picked them up at the airport. Someone's excited. <laughs> Once I picked up my parents, we went and got lunch at one of my favorite restaurants. There was the cutest farmer's market next door, so we walked around for a while and did some shopping. Okay, it's literally three o'clock in the afternoon and we just got notice of Halloween plans for tonight and I have no costumes. So my mom and I are going to go run to a bunch of stores real quick and see if I can piece something together. I'm thinking like Michael's, Hobby Lobby, like all the craft stores. We're gonna try to piece something together real quick and see what we can come up with. Okay, I just got back from all the stores. We literally went to like six different stores. I think I figured out what to be. This is kind of what makes the costume. I found this neck piece that's like fully pearls. It's so cute. I feel like this is kind of like a mermaid vibe. I also found all these like pearl stickers from Hobby Lobby and I'm gonna use these to like put in my makeup and my hair to make it look more like a mermaid. I found this like starfish bracelet which could be cute. I also got this hair waver. I've never used a hair waver before. And then under this, I was thinking of doing like this white bralette that I got. I feel like it might look better if it was gold. So I'm going to go to the warehouse right now and see if Ben could spray paint it gold for me. I don't know how that's going to turn out, but hopefully it works. I'm going to have this man spray paint it. Go ahead. Back up in case I mess it up. We gotta pick out Ben's costume super last second, but good thing he has like a million costumes in here. This is the final mermaid look. I didn't go with the gold top because it just didn't work out. This is the makeup. I put like these little pearls on my face, which took forever. Honestly, it was so fun. Getting ready is like my favorite part ever. For being last minute, this is pretty good. Good morning, guys. It's Sunday. I just woke up. Honestly, feeling pretty good. Ben woke up way early this morning. I don't know how he got up that early because we didn't get back to like 2 a.m. It ended up being really fun. We had a group of like 20 people, so it made it a lot more fun when you have a bunch of friends with you. Ben and my dad are riding their dirt bikes right now. So my mom and I are gonna go have a girls' day. We're gonna go shopping, get some lunch, and go to this like outdoor garden that she's been wanting to go to. It's like fully decorated for Christmas already, and she loves that stuff. And then my parents leave later this afternoon, and Ben and I are gonna have a little date night. We're gonna do like homemade pizzas and go to Disneyland. I'm gonna go get ready for the day so we can have a little girl's day. Outfit for the day, purse. just got done at Roger's Garden. It's like this outdoor garden restaurant with a bunch of plants. They're already fully decorated for Christmas, which is crazy because it's literally October right now. And we didn't get anything because a Christmas ornament was $40, which is insane. 
But now we're gonna go do some shopping at the mall. The Sephora sale is going on right now, so I'm looking to get a whole new makeup routine. So hopefully everything's not sold out, but we're gonna go do some shopping before the boys get back. Tonight we're gonna be doing like make your own pizza night. So I'm gonna go to the store and get some stuff. We're gonna have a little Halloween night tonight. I just got back from the store and I found this pizza dough, which is perfect because we're gonna do build your own pizzas. Since Halloween is coming up, I wanted to do a little build your own pizza night and then you can make it into the shape of ghost if you want for Halloween. I love pizza, Ben loves pizza, so I feel like that's just like perfect for dinner tonight. Ben's not a cook and I'm not the best cook, so this should be an interesting experience for the both of us. <laughs> Okay, these are the pizzas before they go in the oven. Ben just fully copied my design, but that's okay. This is mine. This is Ben's. Mine's better. Unfortunately, I think Ben won this one yeah, somehow, yeah. some way. I don't know what happened to mine. You know what we said. What? I get some massage. Okay. <laughs> I've been wanting to go to Disneyland during Halloween for so long. We ended up getting to the park a little bit later than we had anticipated, and honestly, we did not expect it to be as busy as it was. The Indiana Jones ride was my favorite growing up, so that was the first ride that we went on. After waiting so long in line, it literally got shut down right when we got on it. Someone had to come and escort us off the ride, which I've never had happen before. And then on the second ride we went to, it also got shut down, so honestly our luck with the rides wasn't the best, but it was still really nice to walk around and see all the decorations. 